Greetings everyone, Stefan is here, welcome back for another video, super excited because we have the Insta360 GO 3, 3, this is the latest action camera from Insta360, before I start this video, quick disclaimer, this video is not sponsored, I purchased this camera by myself, so just to make clear that this is, you know, my honest opinion about this interesting camera there's a lot of hype going on about this camera because i think it's interesting so in today's video i'll show you the unboxing what we get uh the price for this camera is 399 pretty decent it's the same territory of the gopro hero 10 11 but this camera can offer a little bit more so let's let's dive in now let's unbox this insta 360 go 3 let's see what you get when you purchase this interesting action camera just to be careful with the packaging because i don't want to damage the box Fair to say, the packaging looks pretty decent. And if I'm honest with you, this is a very, very nice box. And now the moment of true, let's unbox the Insta360 GO 3 for the first time. Wow, this is small. This is very small, ladies and gentlemen. Very nice. And as you can see here, this actually, this is the magnets behind the camera. I'm gonna show you right now. I'm gonna remove this if I can. Come on. Okay. And now, ready for the peeling? Okay, this was terrible. So this is so magnets as you can see here. So you can attach this camera to any magnet surfaces, which is pretty, pretty cool. As you can see, this is the actual size of the camera. This camera is only 35 grams, which is insane. So the reason this camera is so hyped is that you can attach this camera everywhere. And also, let's see what actually, what else you get in the box. I'm gonna leave the camera on the side. Let's unbox now the rest here. So what we have, we have some paper documentations under this tab. So we have, this is the pivot stand or maybe this needs to use with uh, some water, I think. All right. Yeah, this is, oh, this is, yeah, this is nice. So actually you can attach this to the camera directly. The mounting system is amazing. As you can see, this is such a cool, option this is the easy clip i really uh, like this option so you mount this to your hat which is very cool and my favorite accessories is going to be the pendant magnet pendant this is pretty cool because you can attach the go three as you can see this is cool so for your amazing pov shots and actually the magnet is quite strong and i think the start of the show is gonna be the action action pot this ladies and gentlemen is amazing because the previous generation they didn't have the action pot and this actually is like a flip screen here comes and you can do some vlogging 
and you can see all your settings you can uh, change some of the settings and the cool part is that you can attach your go tree here inside of the action pot and voila now charges the way that you remove the go tree is you just press this button here oh boy <laughs> this is cool so that's it's cool because the magnets are quite strong wow super super cool actually this thing is very very nice and it's small and let's test it now look how tiny is this camera it's just insane and the fact that you can remove it from the action pot this is just incredible and the magnets actually are super super strong which this is gonna help you to attach this camera everywhere this is cool another great feature is the flip up screen which this is gonna help you if you want to vlog this is amazing and also the screen actually is quite tight which again is a very good feature another cool feature which i think is amazing it's the quick release this thing is just amazing because as you can see now the camera doesn't move if you want to remove it just press the two buttons here bam easy the easy mount or easy clip is just fantastic because you can attach it to your head i'm gonna demonstrate right now as you can see this takes like a second and now you're ready for the cool head shots and my favorite favorite attachment is the magnet pendant voila and you're ready for your pov shots now and now, so let's test the Insta 360 GO 3. It's a bit windy here outside right now. At least you can hear the sound quality of the uh, two microphones. And I hope the sound is okay. This is 2.7K, 50 frames per second. And the first thing that we're gonna do with this camera is we're gonna see how is the vlog situation. I'm in the park right now and it's a bit windy let's see how is the quality of the actual camera I don't know, I'm looking at the screen which is wrong I should look the lens and we're gonna move to a, a different um, area with a little bit more lights just to see how is the situation with the camera but yeah this is 2.7k 50 frames per second and i think it's on a vivid mode i hope the footage is nice and the stabilization as well which is pretty decent in my opinion for a small action camera uh, let me move to uh, a little bit more bright light to see how is the situation with the lights let me know what do you think as you can see yeah this is the vlogging situation the, the sun is behind me so probably it's not nice let me tap on the screen because the screen will switch off automatically i'm continuously looking at the screen which this is wrong but yeah this is the vlogging situation with this camera how is the sound how is the footage pretty decent in my opinion also i'm gonna test the pendant magnet pendant and also for the easy clip for the hat but yeah so far is great let's move to a, a different location here to see how is the footage also this is the ultra wide setting of the camera also I'm gonna switch to a linear so linear basically if you want to remove this fish eye look so far it's quite um, white how is the quality of the camera and now same settings 2.7k 50 frames per second but now I changed 
the mode of the eye should i say now it's on linear mode so we just remove the fish eye effect i think this way looks much much better if you want to remove this fish eye look i think you should use the ultra wide in the situations that let's say if you vlog if there's a lot of people around you if you want to catch more of the surroundings but uh, this looks pretty good on the screen i hope the footage will be nice when i check that on my computer amazing amazing in my opinion many people are disappointed about the quality that there is no 4k but if i'm honest with you this doesn't bother me at all yeah looks pretty pretty decent and now let's do something fun let's attach this small camera to our chest with our magnet pendant and let's see how this will look like and now this is the pendant magnet and also the sound quality of the go 3 2.7k let me know how is the point of view you can adjust the level and also I can still see myself with the action pot as you can see I hope the quality is good 2.7k 50 frames per second like I mentioned earlier this camera doesn't have a 4k but it's completely fine for me if I'm honest with you because end of the day the more important is how you're going to use the camera not the quality of the video even 1080p is fine all my videos that I shot on my YouTube channel are 1080p so it's completely fine but as you can see this is 2.7k I love that so let me see this looks amazing so let me know in the comments below what do you think about this POV shots pretty decent in my opinion we're gonna go this way just to show you this interesting mounting options the fact that you can attach this to your chest to your hat it's just brilliant you know what let's let's do some running why not let's see how is the footage wow this is pretty stable this is pretty stable and actually I can I can see that the camera is moving I hope the footage is not very uh... oh what's going on here there's the fire what's going on here man why this I hope you can see I hope you can see that as well there's a fire going on here I hope you can see that yeah hope the footage is stable I hope the sound is good many people said that the sound is nice I do like this mounting system now let's switch to a cap mode should I say so we can sit here now enjoy the lovely weather I can see myself in the action pot with the flip up screen beautiful okay let's change that to a cap mode with the easy mount and now this is the easy clip on my hat which I think this is gonna be my second favorite way to attach this camera so the sound is very good and also I can still myself 
with my see myself with the action pot okay so let's try some some running let's go just slow run and just to see how is the footage later this is a slow run I don't run fast actually let's run fast okay not bad not bad I do like this option if you do some sports or if you play some cool activities with your family with your kids I think this is brilliant option and the weather is perfect now for this condition to test this camera obviously I'll test it when the weather is bad as well the go tree is waterproof up to five meters the action pot is not it's only splash resistant but uh, yeah this is cool and I think I think um, the easy clip on the hat is perfect and that concludes our review let's go back to the studio now let's see the footage and I'll continue with this review which I'm super super excited to test this interesting camera which is the size of the AAA battery also let's try the water here Mm. delicious back to the studio and this is a nose mode I don't know why we're gonna do that but um, yeah just I'm gonna show you what this camera can do if you flip the go three to film yourself uh, yeah it's a uh, option that you can do but yeah so this is the nose mode my nose is big and now we're back in the studio and let's wrap this unboxing slash first impressions of the go 3 which actually had a lot of fun filming today uh, this is not a full in-depth review i need to use this camera for a couple of weeks months at least just to give you my full review this is just first impressions and so far it's been good I do like the fact that you can attach this camera to any magnet uh, surfaces which is great it's tiny it's small <laughs> apologize about that um, the flip up screen also is pretty handy if you decide to vlog yourself why not also you have this which is my favorite attachment this basically it's the coolest idea opposite and as you can see bam voila now you can use this with your uh your favorite accessories if you want to remove it press the buttons here attach it again and you can move to a different attachments pretty nice also we have the easy clip attach it to your head and probably my favorite which is the magnet pendant so there we have it guys let me know in the comments below what do you think about the insta360 go 3 you're gonna buy one let me know what is your situation the go pro 12 is coming i believe next month we have the dji action 4 i mean the competition is is crazy so this is all the three I think most popular cameras at the moment so we have the go 3 we have the gopro 12 which is coming after a month we have the dji action 3 and 4 we have the insta 360 x3 which is the 361 
So there we have it, guys. Let me know in the comments below what do you think. If you have any questions, please uh, leave it in the comments below. And make sure to subscribe, turn on your notifications because I'm planning to do crazy stuff with this camera, even attach it to a drone. Why not? See you in the next video.